Alright, another new day. We're very hungry. I think we're on the cusp of someday having our own refrigerator and buying things that we like. We gotta work at Elgato today, and then we're gonna make a big decision about what we're gonna do. The future is bright for Beer America. We made some good money yesterday. We need to check the stock after work today. I may not open it up this evening because I want to see what we've got rolling. Rolling, 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 rolling. Sorry, I'm in a mood today. Yarga doesn't have to deal with it. Get out of the way, girl, on the floor. All right, let's 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 get through the day. Start working. Skip this time. Elgato has served us well, but now maybe the point that we move on from it. Let's get some fresh food. We've got money in our pocket to actually be able to do things that we want to. Don't hit me, taxi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Honk, honk, honk. I just wanted to double check on our stock. It looks like we're good. Okay, we got lots of wine ready to go, martinis, a little bit of beer. I think we, I know I, I know some of y'all were saying, you know, steered schedule for each day. I'll mess with that when we go over full time. But let's see, what time is it now? Four, we'll, we'll go six to 12. Let's go out here and nap. This will probably be the last day we do this because I'm greedy. I'm so greedy. Everybody tells me this on every game I play that I am just greedy. I'm sorry. It's who I am. Like. I don't know why I have this issue. Yes, the walls and floors are ugly. I got it. Just buy stuff. Let me toggle the radio. All right, so we can make some good money here. We may be able to buy. I know a lot of you are saying that I need to meet. I understand the whole thing of meeting the demand of, like, we can only handle 10 people. And we need another drink shelf, another wine shelf, and another drink shelf to meet this 15 demand which is, for the building we're in, this customer capacity. And maybe that's the bigger number. And somebody may be able to correct me. Maybe that's more important than traffic index. So, or maybe I could, could can make this higher by putting more stuff. I don't know. This is our, we, we just started with this. We're just trying to figure it out. Yes, yes, the walls. We can always, uh, if we need to upgrade because we start making a lot of money, we can do that. How many bags do I have? I have 836, so we're good on that. But I think after a couple of days, we'll be able to get like some transportation. We're going to be able to really push the, uh, like, keeping stock in here. I'm like, I'm kind of excited about all that. Look at this. We got people coming in here, buying some martinis. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Floors are ugly. Y'all have let me know in the comment the floors and walls are ugly. The comment section is ugly. It's always. I'm ugly. I can't help it, so I don't show my face on these. Actually, I do. It's it's up here in the top left corner. You can see my face. All right, but we're just trying to make as much money as we can, so tomorrow we can uh, rock out. Turn this radio volume down. I don't want to blast you all away. I, want, I, I mean, they, they can hear it no matter what. I just don't want you all to be, like, stuck with it. All right, we're getting awful tired, but we're almost to the end of the shift. Again, I think aiming for the middle of the day hours would be the best thing. Insufficient energy, really. Three minutes before close. Yeah, I understand that. Seven hundred ninety-three dollars today, man. 
We gotta... I could sleep here for like... Take his little cat nap. Yeah, that'll get us up and going. Look at that! Have y'all ever done that? Just sitting there? I mean, I see people do it all the time. When my grandparents used to go down to Gatlinburg, Tennessee, and Pigeon Forge in that area, my papa would always just sit down on the bench and watch people walk by and doze off for a while, and then he'd get up and be like, Alright, let's go do something! But, you know, sometimes you just gotta take your power nap. And that's what I've done. Alright, so, Elgato Street Market. Tomorrow. Uh, I think... We're going to quit that job. I have done so. So now with me, my net worth is 11000 So I think tomorrow, yeah, because we're almost tripling what we make there. And if we could just stay open in the middle of the day, I think we'll be in great shape. So for Wednesday, let's aim for like eleven. Maybe noon to eight. Let's see what we get there. Yeah, because it starts really trailing off at eight o'clock. So um, that's something we really need to know. Is with that. Is 8 p.m. There's just not a lot of people there, but there's pretty solid people up to that point. If we can find the beginning point, we'll know what hours our place needs. All right, so let's get some rest. We'll sleep in until 8.45. We don't have to open the place tomorrow. We're not working at Elgato. We are low on apples. Let's see. So this is our first day kind of being super independent. Um... And we've got some money to deal with, so let's go down here to A.J. Pedersen and Son. As I've whipped the camera back and forth. And let's see what we can pick up here. I mean, what do we want to get that we can uh, bring into the world? You get a cigar, Chef. You technically get both of those. What other product is like, what's got super high demands? Anything alcoholic? No, martinis back down to 57%. That kind of saddens me. The Zana Man smartwatch is going up. Well, that's great. Your buds. Our lawyer, lawyer fee. Hourly lawyer fee. That's weird that it's listed like that. Um, all the alcohol is down here. I mean, cigar is here at 32. Whiskey is 33. Wine is still here. The martini is still the highest. Croissant and cupcake. So it's a food city. Oh, there's a shortage in the smartwatches. Extra Gananas uh, was shut down. They shut down two clothing stores. The clothing not doing too well right now. So after Martini... We got wine and so whiskey. Where was cigar? Cigars right here. So maybe we just add whiskey. Maybe we do whiskey and add another beer shelf. I'm going to be able to put all this out yet. I'm first. Yeah, because we don't have a lot of product. When we open the day, we'll put this in the bag. Just have it set in there. Actually, we got some beer we could put out. So, we'll see if this helps improve. It's like massive expansion real quick. 
Now when we go to the Elgato to buy stuff, I'm not going to get my employee discount. I'm a little sad about that. My dude's gonna have the strongest legs of anybody in this town. All right, into Beer America. All right, so we gotta figure out how to. Um, much as I hate putting things. Yeah, I need to. I need to move. So let's put one beer shelf here. Image inventory. Give me one of those. That there. And then what do we have here? Uh, 43 beer. Let's stock this one first. Then we'll put this on this. Looks like we gotta we're gonna be running through town here soon. Yeah, buying lots of stuff. Oh, tomorrow may be a big uh actually maybe oh, we don't have the money today. We're gonna have to open today to uh take care of everything. But we may make enough money today to really get consistent after the fact. So let's, um, pack, and then put that drink shelf right there, and this guy. Let's see if that changes anything on our stats we got here, and what it says we can handle. Um, okay, so yeah, we still don't have enough wine to handle 15 customers. We don't have enough martinis, but beer we can handle. And uh, so, yeah, so we should get a big, a little bit more bump in people if we open. So we'll open at noon and see what we could do on a full day at kind of half hour. This one, this, this apartment has a big open window. Like that is going to let a lot of air and cold and everything in. Let's wake up at 11. Wait. I set this to open today. Yes, we open at noon for eight hours. Take his little cat nap. Let's get rocking. Let's do this. Our first true day running Beer America. Um, let's see what kind of music we got on. Uh. Yes, yes. Walls, floors, ugly. Got it. Sure, that sounds great. We'll see what we can do today. There's a first sell. So in less than 15 minutes, we got a first sell. I need to make sure that people can reach everything. It does look like they can. She bought three different items. One item. Okay, just wine for her. That's okay. I really just don't know how much I pay attention to floors when I go into a place. Like, even in, like, furniture stores. I just don't know how much I look at their carpet they have on the ground. I mean, in the end of the day, they're all just a big warehouse that has product in it. Like, maybe that's why I don't run, work at those businesses. We need to actually go buy some real groceries after this. Two employees or two people at once? Oh my god. What a record this has turned out to be. Well, that dude got all sorts of stuff. Yeah, we're going to have to buy a lot of product. I'll probably set up another martini thing. We probably need another wine. We're definitely going to have to put stuff together like it's just shelves. And probably slide it up against the wall. I don't want to do that, but I'm going to have to do that. 
just because of our limited space in here. But it all depends on how much money we make. Uh, like I said, we're going to have to buy more product. I may also turn where my checkout is so people line up. Like I'm facing this way and people line up to the middle. Maybe something we do after we close here in an hour. Though my dude is getting extremely hungry. But you can work tired or hungry. It just, I think it wears your energy out faster. This is kind of like our, what do you call it? Like a pilot opening, I guess. All right. So the day is over. We'll have to see how things go. Let's clean. I know I could tell the floors are filthy. I have to go get us a good snack today to see what we uh, come up with. Like, what I mean is I'm going to have to uh, put these, like, this. much as I hate to. Oh, they don't. So the wine, they don't get on both sides of it. So I guess I can just set it like that. So maybe since the wine has to be that way, this other stuff I can leave cattywampus. Let's see, and then you. Here we go. Now I should be able to edit the queue somehow. There it is. So we'll have them, we'll have them line up here and then go this way. There we go. Um, and how do I save this? Apply. Okay, cool. So they'll line up this way. Excellent. Uh, I don't want to put this bottle on yet. Let's get these little ones here. So we definitely need wine. We definitely need everything, to be quite honest. Yeah, maybe move this like here. We'll put the other beer here. No, put that like there, that there. Um, yeah, I don't know why I got it turned this way. There we go. So you come in, you kind of see all the shelves. And we can still get back here. Okay. So we need another martini thing. We'll do cigars. We just need to see how much money we got. Let's go to the grocery store. Uh, Elgato should be open still. Cross with these people. Buy some uh, some food. How much is 10? 80 bucks for 10 fresh food. You know what? We're going to do it. So that's 10 days of food. Alright, so in a couple hours we'll find out how much money we made. I do need to temporarily close the place. so that it doesn't open on us tomorrow. Because tomorrow we're going to have to figure out what stock we need to go buy. And it's going to take me a while to go back and forth on that. I guess the next thing we're going to have to save up for is a vehicle. That's going to be very important. I'm going to go ahead and eat this apple. Maybe he'll sleep better than that. That may be the last apple we eat for a long time. All right, let's sleep until yeah, eight o'clock in the morning sounds good. Let's see how much money we made. Nine hundred twenty-one dollars. Oh my lord! And that's after paying our sixty dollars rent. So nine hundred, yeah, nine twenty-two. Oh man, that's nice. That uh, that makes me very happy. We need to go in here and get some food. 
I was so excited I almost forgot to eat. Alright, we need to go. I'm dead. Alright, we definitely need to go buy product. Bring it into the store. We need beer. We need wine. No, we got we got a box of wine. So beer and martini first. This is such a long... I mean, I think you can get stuff delivered, but... We're cheap right now still. I think they had an accident. It's rare that you see that between the computers. The computers. I say, say it's like it's like it's family. The computers. Living among us. The computers. AI, I love us. It's actually, we shouldn't joke about that because that's kind of terrifying. All right. So what do we want to get here? Well, we need beer. Beer. Two beer. Get martini. And then, uh, we have the wine. I think we're okay on that. So let's just get another martini. And then, um, so that's 600 bucks right there. And we'll run this all the way back. Run it back now. All right. Brought this back in. Let me park this. Let's get beer. Okay. So I definitely need to flip this one around so it's easier to load. Get the other beer, put it in the back. Let's get the martini, fill this one up. Fill that one up. All right, so we definitely need to go buy some more martinis. Maybe a little bit of wine. Martinis. And uh, we'll see what else fancies us. And then we should be able to open close to normal time. I, I would also be tempted to take a taxi if I saw one right now. We're so far away. What, what, what's he going to charge me? I mean, it was a ripoff last time. 42 bucks. I'm going to do it. It's going to be a business expense. Look at that. Look at that. All right. Um, now I got to remember what we needed. We don't need beer. I know we need a wine or two. Cigars are $738. Good grief. Wine is pretty cheap. We get 50 bottles of wine. Let's get a thing of martini. And, uh, might as well get a beer and then we'll hold this at the place. And then until we decide what we're going to do next, I think this will work. All right. So the voyage back. Y'all are very lucky that I cut a lot of this out for you all because it is tumult tumultuous. Tumultuous? Tumultuous? I don't know. I was sitting there thinking, somebody said, oh, you should rent one of the scooters. They should just make it to where you could buy your own personalized scooter and pull it out when you want to. Or park it in front of your house. Uh, or apartment or wherever you rent. I think that would be pretty cool. Which, again, this game's still pretty much in early access, so there's a lot more for them to do. But uh, let's get this back, and then hopefully we can open by at least 2 o'clock. Maybe do like a 2-8 two to, two to eight run or something like that. We'll just have to see. All right, let's turn the corner. The Suits Law Firm. Trust a suit. All right, so this stuff is all just pretty much just stock to go back here. that 
bottle of wine in the wrong spot, but that's okay. All right, let's put this up. Let's see what we can do today opening this place. Let's go to my schedule. Shift this up. I don't think we'll make it to 9 o'clock because we're so tired, to be honest with you. Oh, can I not get back there? Oh, I bet that, uh... Okay, it's it's being iffy about this. Okay, we want the queue to go here, and then here, and then here. Okay. All right, I think we fixed it. So we got a lot more stuff out now. We should be able to handle, yeah, martinis, beer, Shopping baskets, everything is set. We do need another thing for wine, and then I'm not sure for cigars if there's a difference in the size of like um liquor store cigar. Do the cigar shelves have a different customer capacity 20? So we need a medium cigar shelf to handle what we want. What's the small one do? 15. So yeah, we well, we could get away with the small one. So that may be something to think about going in the future. Do we do the small or the medium? My thought is the medium because it will be better when we grow. But uh, we'll have to set to see. But we do need another wine shelf, I guess. We're covering everything else here. Beer America is trying to do its best. Nobody's here during the after school crowd. What's going on? Okay, good martinis. So yeah, maybe our next goal is we get the cigar going and then, I don't know, maybe we need to save up for a vehicle first. We look at cars on this thing. I don't know if there's a search. I don't know if there's a car. Like you can look at your cars here. Vehicles. There we go. Um, five hundred twenty thousand forty-eight. I know. So the Hazda Minmic is the cheapest. It has eight cargo. What was the next one up from it? A van has 14 cargo. That may be the best thing to get. So yeah, maybe we save up $8,000 and get a van so we have 14 cargo capacity. Is it the most awesome thing to drive when you're wanting to run a business? No, but... It's probably something that's necessary for us. All right, we're about to end the day. Let's make one last sale here. Right. Nicely done, we survived the day. I don't think I'm gonna have the energy to... I should have the energy to clean. Time to do the shelves. Uh, eight. So we sold 18 beer, 15 plus 9, 24 of those, and quite a bit of wine. Let's stock up real quick. the same issue with uh this this box is in the wrong place so we got lots of wine all right i 
think that'll be fine on those. And then martinis. You're too exhausted to move at full speed. Cool. Um, we'll go out here and take a nap. Take a nap. We'll go home and then we'll see how much uh, money we made for the day. So I guess 900 is our limit now. So we kind of want to see if we get close to that. Let's sleep for let's sleep for just a straight up hour. Or so, all right, there we go. I mean, when you start opening that business full time, you're you're gonna you're gonna probably make yourself so tired you're gonna go home and cry in bed at night just to get acclimated to how everything feels. But yeah, I'm kind of curious to see what we come off on. I also want. Oh, we're in the house to check out Bizman and see was it insight? Yeah, it falls way off the eight o'clock. So that is yeah, eight PM is the thing. It's probably the limit. Alright, I just want to sleep for an hour. To see what our money is we made 913 bucks all right so we're hitting about 900 a day after expenses so decisions to make vehicle or expand with cigars and such that's what we got to decide hey everybody i'm steven thomas subscribe if you have not and if you enjoyed the video and you want to help the channel grow all you got to do is hit that like button down below. Also, if you want to support the channel, there's a plethora of ways to do that down in the description. And as always, thank you all so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.